right, back on the video, y'all see we got Mitch Hedberg. Definitely go ahead, check this one out, you feel me? Uh, this is Why I Hate Dreaming. This is a new comedian to the channel. Definitely ready to go ahead and check him out. Me and a lot of other comedians, and y'all had commented this comedian. You know what I'm saying? So definitely ready to go ahead and jump into this one. Make sure you hit that like, hit that subscribe, and let's get in the video. For the hilarious Mitch Hedberg. I like to wear this pass because it helps me know when I'm upside down. <laughs> hey, uh, I was getting my teeth whitened, but then I said, forget that, I'll just get a tan instead. I saw a billboard, it said, estimated at Lotto Jackpot, 55 million. See, I didn't know that shit was estimated. That would suck if you want to go, oh, we were off by two zeros. <laughs> we estimate that you are angry. <laughs> I like rice. Rice is great when you're hungry and you want 2,000 of something. <laughs> I saw a commercial on late night TV. It said, forget everything you know about slip covers. So I did. <laughs> and it was a load off my mind. <laughs> then the commercial tried to sell slip covers, but I didn't know what the hell they were. <laughs> you guys are cool, man. Canada is all right. I like the American Canadian border because if you're walking along the border with a friend and you push your friend into Canada, he can't push you back right away because first he has to go through customs. Damn. What brings you to Canada, that asshole? <laughs> when you leave it, when I regain my equilibrium? <laughs> I went to the doctor, all he did was suck blood from my neck. Do not go see Dr. Acula. <laughs> Dr. Scholl makes foot products. And he's a doctor, so he went to school for a long time. But it doesn't take a lot to figure out that stepping on a cushion will be more comfortable. <laughs> that guy wasted lots of time at school. Cause I'd have bought that shit from a Mr. Show. <laughs> Maybe even a senior show. <laughs> I got a belt on that's holding up my pants. And my pants have belt loops. I hold up my belt. I don't know what's really happening down there. Who is the real hero? <laughs> I walk by a dry cleaner at 3 a.m. He literally like a like a straight like a straightforward comedian. Like he just. It's, I thought like you just saying the jokes like one after another. Like what you mean? Like different ones. Yeah, he just straightforward with the shit. He just he just hang you one one after another one after another. I walk by a dry cleaner at 3 a.m. And the sign says, sorry, we're closed. You don't have to be sorry. It's 3 a.m. and you're a dry cleaner. It would be ridiculous for me to expect you to be open. I'm not going to walk in at 10 a.m. and say, hey, man, I walked by at 3 and you guys were closed. Somebody owes me an apology. I called the hotel operator. She said, how can I direct your call? Well, you could say action. And I will begin to dial. Then when I say goodbye, you can yell cut. And if you want, you can wear a beret and knickers. Is a hippopotamus a hippopotamus or a really cool apotamus? <laughs> hey man, if you're a fish and you want to become a fish stick, you have to have very good posture. <laughs> you can't be a slouchy fish or you will be a fish clump. <laughs> I went to the store, I bought eight apples. The clerk said, do you want me to put them in a bag? I said, oh no, man, I juggle. <laughs> but I can only juggle eight. If I'm ever here buying nine apples, bag them up. <laughs> I got a new CD, it's in stores. And when you have a CD in stores, you have to do in-store appearances. If nobody shows up, I just pretend like I'm shopping. <laughs> That's how I shop. I sit behind a table with a pen. I hate to dream. Dreaming takes energy. Sleeping is supposed to be a rela relaxing affair. I lay down on the bed. It feels great. Next thing you know, I have to build a go-kart with my ex-landlord. <laughs> hey, if you can't sleep, count sheep. Don't count endangered animals. You will run out. <laughs> I order the club sandwich all the time, and I'm not even a member, man. I don't know how I get away with it. So well, my sandwiches with three pieces of bread. So do I. Well, let's form a club. 
Okay, but we need some more stipulations. Yes, we do. Instead of the cutting the sandwich once, let's cut it again. <laughs> Hell yeah, four triangles. We will position them into a circle. And in the middle, we will dump chips. <laughs> or potato salad, cool. I can deal with that. <laughs> Let me ask you a question. How you feel about frilly toothpicks? I'm for them. <laughs> well, this club is formed then. I like to take a toothpick and throw it in the forest and say, you're home. Hell no. Some people think I'm high on stage. I would never get high before a show. Because when I'm high, I don't want to stand in front of a bunch of people that I don't know. That does not sound comfortable. Like when you're high and a joke doesn't work, it's extra scary. It's like, whoa, what the hell happened there? I am retreating within myself. Why have all these people gathered? And why am I elevated? <laughs> why am I not facing the same way as everyone else? <laughs> and what is this electric stick in my hand? I like the way this is situated here. It seems like you guys were chasing me, closing in, then said, fuck it, let's sit down. <laughs> <laughs> All right, thank you very much. Nah, he was he was cool though. He was cool. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Cool. It wasn't it wasn't really uh my my I don't know like my taste or yeah. it's something that like I more so like I guess I gotta step like out of my comfort zone because of like his style of comedy. You know what I'm yeah. saying? Um I guess I'm just not used to that, you know what I'm saying? But Maybe um he has different ones. Yeah, hopefully, you feel me? Hopefully y'all comment down uh some more, you feel me? Um Definitely, definitely uh, want to check out more uh, to, to, to check him out um, and see what else he got. Because um, like I said, um, I really can't say his comedy ain't for me because, I mean, this is the first video we watched. But yeah. um, this is one that was, it was cool. You know what I'm saying? It was cool. Um, definitely, definitely want to hear more. So make sure y'all comment down below and let us know. Um, but y'all already know, to hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. Definitely appreciate y'all for tuning in. Um, y'all already know. Catch y'all next time.